Colon hydrotherapy is similar to an enema, however an enema serves to flush out only the rectum and sigmoid colon because it allows for only water inflow. Then treatment must be stopped for the patient to release water and waste on the toilet. Colon hydrotherapy, on the other hand, cleanses the entire length of the colon all the way to the cecum. This is because in addition to inflow, colon hydrotherapy also allows outflow via the waste hose and directly into the sanitary sewer system. This lets the treatment continue with the patient remaining on the treatment table. Colon hydrotherapy's simultaneous inflow and outflow of water is made possible by a specifically designed speculum. During the procedure, the practitioner will initiate a fill cycle, temporarily stopping water outflow. When the patient feels full, the practitioner will initiate an empty cycle, enabling water outflow with water and waste flowing directly into the sanitary sewer system. A series of fill and empty cycles span the 45-minute procedure. While the principle of this method of colonic irrigation is very similar to an enema, it is far more effective. An enema essentially is only one fill cycle with the empty cycle happening on the toilet. A colon hydrotherapy session, on the other hand, allows for anywhere between 15 and 30 fill and empty cycles. Patients typically only begin to release significant amounts of fecal matter after three to four fill and empty cycles, making colon hydrotherapy a far more effective method of colonic irrigation. Each fill and empty cycle serve to bring water further up the colon, eventually reaching the cecum and cleansing the farthest reaches of the colon. Because water is able to reach to the very end of the colon during the treatment, the 45-minute procedure completely empties the large intestine of fecal matter.